Good morning guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I honestly just wanted to vlog and working from home today and I just thought it would be super fun to just vlog my day for you guys. So I don't really have too, too much planned today. I have to go pick up my car at some point from the dealership, clean, and I just wanna have a really, really productive day. So figured I'd take you guys along in a day, take you guys along with me. These are some of my favorite vlogs to film and I'm really, really excited. So I started, I'm super excited to say that today's video is sponsored by Health Classes. I'm really excited to be partnering with them, especially in quarantine, you guys know I've been trying to better myself and just be a healthier version of myself and to use this time productively. I'm all spending a lot of time inside right now and so I think that it's a great opportunity to better yourself and to learn more and educate yourself and I've talked about it before on my channel, but I'm really excited to be collaborating with them today. They're a site that has an online library of a ton of online courses taught by the world's leading experts in health health, nutrition, wellness, and lifestyle. Everything on their website from diet changes, debunking food myths, traditional medicine, and alternative medicine. The one I'm most excited to take is this Food Scams You're Wasting Your Money On by Larry Olmstead. I think it's so important to learn to shop smart at the grocery store and, and what to avoid when dining out, and I think it's something we don't talk about a lot. And I'm really excited to watch this one and better myself and learn to understand food labels more and ingredients and kind of what to watch out for. The other thing about the site is that all the videos are 8 to 12 minutes long, so they're super Anyways, if you guys are interested in checking out health classes, they were super, super kind enough to give me a discount code for you guys. So you guys can use code CS40 for 40% off your pass. I'd love to know down below what you guys are most interested in checking out. So much health classes for collaborating with me on today's video, and let's start the day. You guys are cute new little welcome mat. I'm gonna bring it in because it's so loud outside. Etsy, I can link it down below if you want. But how cute is this and how me is this? I oh, cute. It's not downstairs because I'm scared someone's gonna steal it, so we're keeping it up here. I'm trying to like amp up my Instagram and just be like more consistent with posting. Um, so I want to take a picture with the mat today, as well as I want to take a picture of the coffee cart and have like a whole row of home decor Instagram pictures. So we'll see how that turns out. So I want to do that today as well. Um, anyways, so that's that. I'm gonna clean up the kitchen a little bit, um, put dishes away. Let me know if you guys get, like, tired of seeing me clean. I don't know. I just get comments all the time telling me how much you guys like how productive I am. And don't get me wrong, I'm not always productive, so that, but I feel like you guys like to see it. But let me know if you guys are tired of it, because I don't want to get too repetitive, you know? So, let me, let me know. But I'm gonna go clean up the kitchen, put away some dishes. I just like to have a nice, clean kitchen, and I'll probably break my fast soon. Um... And then I get ready and film a video. Time for coffee number dose. Okay guys, it's currently 11. I just moved downstairs. I don't know what it is, even though I have an office now, I still need to like move and get work done in different spots to stay focused. I think that's normal though. I hear a lot of people say that like working from home, they move spots a lot. So I, I don't know. I just gravitate here cause it's nice and sunny. So work done probably for like an hour or so and then call it quits for the day. Um, but we're gonna do a bit more work, answer some emails and then I need to clean the house. I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. I was gonna film a separate video, but I'm not sure. But if you guys like this one, let me know and I'll film a whole separate cleaning video. But for now, I'm just gonna insert it here because I'm not sure if you guys really want a cleaning video, but yeah. Also just made myself a giant a lemon water. I was just craving it, it sounded so good. Still working on my coffee and we're gonna get back to work now. up work for the day and I'm gonna start cleaning um, I'm gonna start with the kitchen like everything to be clean once a week so that is our plan 
and let's get to cleaning. And I use just a like all natural disinfecting spray. It's the bamboo one, it's so good. And then I also just use a heavy duty degreaser for the stove. Room one is done, kitchen is clean. So nice and clean, I even scrubbed down the cabinets you guys saw because they were just getting so dirty, but everything is so clean. I love when the stove top is clean and those dishes are just drying. And I think now we'll tackle the living room since we're already on this floor and then we'll do the bathrooms later. Next, we're just obviously gonna do the bathroom upstairs. I just figure while I'm at it, let's just get all of it done, you know? Here, so I have a glass spray. Um, this is just the bathroom cleaner we use, like the all-purpose one. It's a foaming bathroom cleaner and eucalyptus. Um, I've got a toilet spray and then a daily shower spray. So normally I spray down the toilet right when I get in here because I let it sit and then I'll clean the counters and then the shower. water what's new it's currently 12 30 and they just called me to say that my car is ready and originally Matt and I were just gonna go after work tonight but um my mom's gonna come get me and take me which is so so sweet of her um I don't know what it is if anyone else feels like this but I have really bad anxiety when I don't have my car like to the point where like I just can't get stuff done like and I know that's a first world problem and Matt was saying the same, like he feels the same, but like when I don't have my car, 
um, I just get really anxious. It's like one of my anxiety triggers. Um, like if we, and not so much with Matt, but like let's say I went out with my friends one night and I'm not the one who drove, like I would have major anxiety the whole night because I can't leave if I want to if that makes sense. Um, so anyways, like as much as I love being home, I love our house, like it's just giving me so much anxiety to not have my car. So my mom's gonna pick me up and take me to get my car. We're gonna pay for my brand new tire. And I'm gonna show you guys my new favorite snack. Guys, okay. I mean, you guys, well, if you guys don't already know, I have really bad IBS and I'm, I'm lactose intolerant, but I still eat dairy. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm gluten intolerant too, but I think the whole world is. These are the best thing in the world. Matt's sister-in-law introduced me to them and they are gourmet biscotti, but they're so good. I was never a biscotti person before, but they're just so freaking yummy. These are the cocoa and almond ones. And oh my God, I could snack on these all day long. And the best thing about them is that they don't hurt my stomach. So they're like the perfect little dessert for me. But anyways, I finished like this whole bag in like two days. They're so freaking good, you guys. Um, but they're gluten-free, wheat-free, dairy-free, soy-free, corn-free. So they don't hurt my tummy at all. But anyways, I'm gonna have a few of them because they're like my favorite thing in the freaking world. So that's my little rant of the day. I'm gonna eat my biscotti. And I'm gonna go get my car. And Brooklyn is so sweet. And yesterday she sent me a Starbucks gift card. I didn't vlog it because I was just in a bad mood. Uh, so maybe we'll go get Starbucks. Thanks to Brooke. But I'm just waiting for my mom. And that's my little update for now. I will update you guys later. I feel good now that the house is clean though. I also love the smell of our cleaners because they're like all natural and they just smell so yummy. Like the house smells so good. And uh, yeah, when I get back, maybe we can go and uh, when we get back, maybe we can go and sit outside, relax. I want to get a workout in at some point, but that's uh, that's my that's my update for now. We are back in Darth, and I'm so happy. Am I the only one who names my car? Because I don't think I am, but Matt doesn't have a name for his car. This is Darth Vader. We love him. He's a bad, bad ass, boss ass bitch. We love him. My last car's name was Frank. Like. Anyways, we're in the Starbucks drive-thru right now. If you have a negative comment, like I'm just gonna say right now, keep it to yourself. Like I don't want to hear it. Okay, guys, I work in healthcare. Things are opening again. I have a Starbucks gift card. I'm going through the drive-thru. Like I just, my last video, someone literally had the nerve to tell me how stupid I was for going to pick up Starbucks on a table outside when I was practicing all the proper precautions. Hi, I just want to let you know that I have been exposed to COVID six times. Okay, I've stayed in my house for the last two months. Matt and I literally would go do groceries and that's it. Like we did not really eat, we didn't eat out. We didn't go out anywhere. Like, so I really think it's harmless me going through the Starbucks drive-thru right now, considering things are opening back up. If this was like two weeks ago, I'd be like, attack me because I can make my coffee at home. But you know what? Things are opening back up. I'm contributing to the economy. But like the person in the last video who had the nerve to tell me that I was being stupid and reckless for going to pick up coffee on a table, I was like, huh? What? Cause like, there's no human interaction. Anyways, whatever. If I want to get coffee, that's my risk. But just know, I've been working my ass off and I think I deserve a little coffee, so. I'm gonna get a venti today and treat myself. Cause I deserve it. How are you doing today? Hi, good, how are you? Good, thank you. What can I get started for you? Um, Can I please get a venti vanilla sweet cream cold brew with no vanilla syrup? Yeah, for sure. Awesome, thank you so much. Have a good day. I forgot to ask for the nitro lid. Also, if you guys go to Starbucks, they're doing this really cool thing where they're putting it in a mug so that you don't have to grab it directly. Oh, guys, this is about to be so freaking good. Oh, I'm going to show you guys my lunch because it's so random. Oh, the cupboard's open. That's bothering me. So I'm going to close that. So you guys, my lunch, this is the life of moving out. You just eat really random leftovers. So um, I made myself a little cheese board. Brie, balsamic, turkey pepperettes, and these crackers. So good. And then... This is like a weird mixture. I just had pulled pork leftover, so I tried to make like, kind of like a Santa Fe salad, but it didn't really work. So there's Santa Fe onion tomatoes, and maybe I'll put a little Caesar dressing on it, but that's my lunch. I'm not super hungry. I don't know about you guys, but when it gets warm out, I just like don't really have an appetite. Is anyone else like that? My whole family's like that. We just like don't really eat much when it's hot out. Um, but I'm also having donuts later, so I feel like maybe, you know, the salad ain't a bad idea. So I'm supposed to film a sit down video today, but at the same time, I might just film it this weekend just because it's so nice outside. And, and this is what I want to reiterate to you guys that like, it's okay to change your plans. If I don't get to working out today, it's not the end of the world to me. I'm not going to hurt myself on it. I'm not going to beat my body up for it. I'm not going to starve myself for it. Like it's so nice outside that I would rather just get outside and enjoy it. Um, so I might not film a video today because I don't want to be cooped up inside, you know? So it's okay to change your plans. Um, I know for me that gives me a lot of anxiety because I'm like a very like 
time walking person, but you just gotta learn to go with the flow of life. So I'm gonna eat my lunch. I may edit a little bit just because I think tomorrow will be a pretty busy day. And oh, I'm gonna go take an Instagram picture really quick. I'm such a girl. And then we're gonna eat lunch and then we're gonna go sit aside and read because I just got a new book and I'm so excited about it. for the next two days but I figured I would do one of my little like egg bakes because I can eat it this weekend too so I'm going to do two eggs with probably two third cups of egg whites I got some onions chopped up in here bacon and some cheese the grocery store it's 4 40 i made a pit stop at matt's parents to drop off some stuff but i'm really before we go i wanted to do a quick little grocery haul from walmart i didn't get you too much i needed more random things okay so like i said i wanted to get sandals and i got these ones and i got some like um these kind of shoes like birkenstock knockoffs and they were 15 bucks hi yes i'm literally gonna wear them right now a cute shirt which i'm so excited about once again you guys are sleeping on walmart this is so cute. Um, I think this would be so adorable for work, tucked into some black pants. It just looks like this. It's white, it's ruffly. So, so cute, got that. That was $15. Got some Fresca. And then strawberries were on sale and these are the best strawberries in the world. So I got some. Um, and then I got makeup wipes because I was out of them. And then I also had to get new highlighter because I'm taking my grad photos this weekend and I don't have any. So I got this e.l.f. one in something i don't know what it's called baked something so i'm gonna put all this away and then head over for a dinner but i'm here just because when i get back it's gonna be probably close to bedtime so i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you did enjoy subscribe if you're not already let me know what videos you guys want to see and i'll talk to you guys in my next one